2009 17-inch MacBook Pro hard drive disk upgrade. Go ahead and start by removing the seven short Phillips head screws starting at the top left and going around the contour of the MacBook clockwise. Now remove the three long Phillips head screws. By removing these ten screws the panel should now come free. Lift and remove the cover. Start off by disconnecting the battery. Pull on the lever and pry it out of its socket. Hard drive disk removal. Remove the hard drive bracket first. It's being held in with two Phillips head screws. They don't have to ha come all the way out. Just about three or four turns each. Lift up and remove the bracket. Pry out the hard drive at an angle and disconnect it from the SATA cable. You remove the four T6 screws. You'll need to transfer them onto the new hard drive. Hard drive disk reinstallation. Install the four T6 screws on the sides of the new hard drive. Reconnect the SATA cable first. Put the drive in at an angle, bottom first. Then just drop it into the socket. Reinstall the hard drive bracket. Again, it's two Phillips head screws. Reconnect the battery. This might be a little tricky. Uh, try to get underneath and get a better viewing angle at the socket. Go ahead and just push that in. Make sure it's firmly in. Reinstall the cover. Reinstall three long Phillips head screws first starting in the top right and going leftwards. Now the seven short Phillips head screws starting in the top left and going around the contour of the MacBook. Perform a NVRAM reset. This will improve boot time dramatically. 